Let's get started with Lumi Keys Studio Edition with per key pitch bend, MPE compatibility, and light guided composition to spark new ideas. Your tracks will enter a whole new dimension. First things first, download Rolly Connect if you haven't already. Once you've registered your Lumi Keys, you'll find all your included software under the Apps tab. Start with Rolly Dashboard. This is where you'll customize Lumi Keys for your workflow. When you first connect your Lumi Keys to Dashboard via USB, you might be prompted to update your firmware. If you have more than one Lumi, connect and update each Lumi one at a time. Next, download Rolly Studio Player. Rolly Studio Player is an incredible tool for composing and producing tracks. It's packed with presets from world-leading sound designers, and its custom integration with Lumi Keys helps you find inspiration fast. You can open Rolly Studio Player as a standalone app or as a plugin inside your DAW. For this video, we're using Ableton Live 11, so we'll find it right in my Plugins folder. Of course, you can use Lumi Keys with whatever DAW you have. Logic Pro, FL Studio, Cubase, GarageBand, you name it. Lumi Keys is the first illuminated MIDI controller with per key pitch bend. It's perfect for adding more expression or a vibrato effect to any sound. You can bend the pitch up or down a semitone on every key just by moving your finger from side to side. Let's try pitch bend with an electronic pad preset. To enable pitch bend in Rolly Studio Player, make sure that hardware control is on. Then select the music note in the bottom right, choose MPE mode, and enable pitch bend. To enable pitch bend in Ableton Live 11, go to Preferences, MIDI, and enable MPE for your Lumi. If you're using third-party virtual instruments, Lumi Keys has four different modes which you can cycle through by pressing the power button. You can also customize these modes in Rolly Dashboard to speed up your workflow. To enable pitch bend for a third-party synth, scroll to the mode you have selected. Then choose Enable Pitch Bend. Lumi Keys is the first illuminated controller featuring MIDI Polyphonic Expression, also known as MPE. This gives you the ability to add incredible expression to your tracks as you play, as well as pitch bend. There's strike, the velocity with which you hit each key, like this. Then there's pressure, how deeply you press into each key. Finally, there's lift off, how quickly you lift your fingers off each note. As you can see, there's much more expression at your fingertips with Lumi Keys than with a standard MIDI keyboard. If you're using Lumi Keys with DAWs or synths that are not fully MPE compatible, you may need to open Rolly Dashboard and choose Polyphonic Aftertouch under Pressure Tracking to ensure that the press gestures are received correctly. There are hundreds of world-class presets in Rolly Studio Player pulled from powerful sound engines including Equator 2 and nearly all of them are compatible with Lumi's expressive gestures. You can browse presets by sound engine, sound source, or instrument. You can also filter for MPE versus standard presets. Standard presets, marked orange, are compatible with Lumi and will recognize pitch bend, velocity, pressure, and lift. Presets are designed for maximum responsiveness from controllers like the Rolly Seaboard and feature full MPE compatibility. Every preset has five adjustable macros to play with as well. Whether you're using sounds from Rolly Studio Player or a different virtual instrument, you can adjust the sensitivity of these expressive parameters in Rolly Dashboard. 
With this, you can find the perfect level of responsiveness for your playing style. Let's try playing around with this preset. First, let's adjust Strike. Let's set Strike to this level. If you want each key to sound the same, no matter how hard you strike it, choose Fixed Velocity. Now, let's adjust Pressure. Finally, I'll tweak Lift Off. Perfect. Of course, you can play Luby keys like a standard piano keyboard without expressive parameters if you like. If you're playing in Rolly Studio Player, turn off Pitch Bend and Pressure here. In Single Channel Mode, without full MPE, you can also set how Lumi responds to Pitch Bend under Pitch Bend Tracking. All this means is that when you're playing a chord, you can bend the pitch of every note in the chord by bending the highest notes, lowest notes, or the last played note. In MPE mode, every note will bend separately, like this. The lights on Lumi keys don't just look amazing, they also help spark your creativity. In Rolly Dashboard, you can set the scale, plus the brightness, and a custom color for any of your four modes. This is great if you're using Lumi keys with third-party software. And when you're connected to Rolly Studio Player, you can do even more. You can choose your key right here. This is a great opportunity to try out scales that you might not have composed with before. The lights on Lumi keys mean you can't go wrong. Or you can activate Smart Chords, which lets you play whole chords at the touch of a key, all fixed to your chosen scale. It's a great way to come up with cool chord progressions. With Smart Chords selected, you'll see every note in the chord light up on Lumi keys while you play. You don't need to know in-depth music theory to experiment with complex chords and progressions. Just adjust the chord type here, or maybe add some strum. As well as chords, you can also light up arpeggios with Rolly Studio Player's multi-layered arpeggiator. There's a whole bunch of different parameters to experiment with here, including the rate and the swing. The creative possibilities are limitless when you compose with light on Lumi keys. The magnetic DNA connectors on either side of Lumi Keys Studio Edition makes it easy to expand your playing surface. Many players are using two Lumi Keys together, but you can actually play up to four at the same time on desktop. Simply snap on another like this, and Rolly Studio Player, or the third-party synth you're using, will immediately recognize that there are two Lumi Keys connected. That's all there is to it. LumiKeys also connects to Rolly Lightpad block and control blocks with the DNA connectors. Their custom integration with Rolly Studio Player will speed up your workflow and inspire new composition ideas. If you snap on a Lightpad block like this, you now have control over on-screen parameters in Rolly Studio Player. From macros and effects, to smart chords, and the multi-layered arpeggiator. Just click the drop-down arrow on the Rolly Studio module that you want to control and assign it to the Lightpad block. Check it out. You can create entire tracks using just Lumi Keys and Rolly Studio Player. But like any other MIDI controller, Lumi Keys is also compatible with your favorite third-party synths and samplers as well. And as more software developers like Ableton are adopting MPE, you have more options than ever before to make full use of Lumi's expressive capabilities. Let's lay down a track with Lumi Keys Studio Edition and Rolly Studio Player in Ableton Live 11. The song is in E minor, so let's select that here. Let's pick this sound in Rolly Studio Player. Now we'll adjust the macros. Perfect. Now that we've recorded a lead, let's add some chords with Rolly Studio Player's smart chords. How about this sound this time? Let's adjust those chord parameters too.
It's not bad. But let's try adding some effects with the Rolly Studio Player Effects module. Okay, time to add an arpeggio with the multi-layered arpeggiator. For this sound, we don't want to use pitch bend, so let's make sure it's turned off. Great. To add the finishing touches, let's record another layer into the Ableton project. But this time, let's use a third-party plugin rather than Rolly Studio Player. Perfect. LumiKey's Studio Edition with your software suite gives you unlimited options for creativity. And this is just the start. Try it out for yourself.